Hello everyone, I am SM72, yours truly, Silver Mario 72. Welcome back to Time Splitters 2. It's a lot of twos. 2315 Robot Factory. This is the second to last that we will be doing in terms of easy mode. So the Robot Factory, after the Machine Wars, the mighty foundries and production lines finally fell silent. Except for one. Alternate sources have revealed that the Dark Mechanist machinist mechanist whatever child have has activated a power node network and seeks to build a robot army to exact his revenge wow this is long neutralize his factory before he can reawaken a dreadful conflict once you have accessed the inner processing area you should proceed immediately with destroying the individual energy nodes these nodes are extremely robust and cannot be damaged using conventional firearms However, the factory may still contain a small number of electro tools, which is a weapon, portable generators that were used in the construction of the factory itself, which may be capable of overloading the nodes using a sustained beam of electricity. Once the nodes have been disabled and the production lines finally silenced, your last objective should be to find the dark mechanic's child and ensure he is stopped for good. And if and of course we won't actually be able to well you'll see so as you see that picture is actually the boss <laughs> to be completely honest but uh it's really not as bad as you think it is so this um, opening cutscene is kinda just like you'll see making robots <laughs> this is the mechanist. I guess that's what it is. I have no idea how to pronounce mechanist. I guess that that's what it is. I'm just gonna say. It. Jesus. Oh yes, and of course, and then we have this, <laughs> this random robot chick just come in who we're going to be playing as, so, yeah, let's just do it. Plasma auto rifle once again. Chassis bots, they're really weak. Really weak. Some of them respawn, some of them don't. They carry sci-fi hang- We already have this much ammo on this gun, so... Now, don't touch this laser, you will get hurt. This thing switches it to the enemy. Defense mode! Wow, okay. And then, yeah, again, you'll see the difference. You can see it switch colors. Dete detection mode, which hurts us, and defense mode, which hurts them. So that's just something while they're asleep, if you're wondering. They haven't awakened or whatever. Over here, you'll find a blue shield. Door is locked. Come on, this thing, and you can simply just shoot that or just run through, and then it dies. And now you can go through the shield, and... Yep, we just got 12 plasma grenades. Activate this thing. You'll extend the bridge, which is outside. I like the music for this too. Sentry bot right there, the one that's just walking around. They're kind of powerful. Yeah, just simply do that. I mean, why not? Alright. Yeah, okay. When you come in this room... 
와. You can't destroy them like that. You have to shoot their head, and that's how you destroy them. They're not actually like a playable character. They're just there as background stuff. But anyways, whoa! Ah. As you can see, they don't mess around. Immediately fire a grenade, just like that. I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys, this is going to this is this may be the hardest level overall. I have no idea. I guess we'll find out. Yeah, we have the maximum ammo right now. By the way, watch out because this thing will follow you and, and you just want to shoot it to explode. I'm not taking a hit right now. I could have because it's easy mode, but whatever. Maybe later. You can see his legs, so we're going to do this. Yes, he's dead. There's another one right here. And he had... I love this weapon. This is the laser gun. I will show it off in a little bit just because uh, I want more ammo for it. Basically, you know what? Press Z, just press it. You put up a shield, but then eventually you're, it starts to drain, as you can see. So turn that off. Um... Press R slowly, just fire little bits like this. Or you can hold and let go to fire an extremely powerful, accurate blast. This gun is awesome. Oh, we were just here. Okay, never mind. Take a look at. Yeah, no secondary objectives. Okay. Alright, so. This thing fires homing rockets, apparently. I don't know why. And it somehow died, maybe because he helped us. Once again, that thing is just... This is the Electro Tool. Ah. Yeah, this is a, but if you fire at something that's like you hurt yourself if you do that it reflects off it and if it turns red then yeah you can see that you're clearly hurting yourself so you don't want to do that I don't know why that does that but whatever so basically awesome thing about the electric tool is you can Take out, you need to take out these things. Go into dance mode, guys. Whatever. Yay. Some sort of camera, but whatever. We don't care about that. Alright. Um, oh, whoa, hey. I definitely want to shoot those earlier. Now, this thing is a little bit different. This thing actually walks... The best way to kill this thing is to fire a grenade at it. 
Uh, sort of like that. There we go. And it's dead. Where's my electro tool? Oh shit, do I need more? I think I do. So if you run out, then... Oh, but there's some over there, so find one of those and you'll be good. C button does the same thing. <laughs> it's so fun to... They dance like that. <laughs> checkpoint, this is the checkpoint. You can actually move this camera back and forth to see what's up. Alright, yeah, it's pretty awesome. Okay. So awesome doing that. If you hear that noise, that's the sentry bots, so activating crane. That's this is what moves this thing a bit closer. God dang it. Alright, we're gonna have to get more. There he is, right over there. Yeah, just do that. Oh god, ow. Oh, hey. They have a bunch of laser guns, so don't worry about it. Yes. Need more laser gun. Blue shield right over here for you. Yeah, so we got a lot of laser gun right now. Alright, one second, guys. Alright, so we got a bunch of laser gun. Oh wow, did I really kill him with one shot? Yeah, I did. Alright, let's see here. Activate this thing. Activating transporter. You're wondering what the hell I'm doing right now. Well, this thing will be significant in a little bit. Now, you don't have to use this thing, but... You know, if you want to prepare, then you'll see what, what I mean what happens. As you can see... Definitely don't want to do that. Here you'll find a homing launcher. Just do that. You want to break the shield. Alright, now we can simply, uh, now what is it? Take care of this.
This moves the energy node. You'll see what it does. And then, as you can see, this automatically sets an electro tool off. Now, I must warn you guys to get ready. By the way, I'll show off the shield. Uh, oh shit. Put up your shield. It doesn't necessarily work that well, but still gets the job done. As you can see, he missed me because clearly I had a shield on. More homing launcher just so because. As you can see, this is very easy. And that's it. Then you just simply run through and. Uh, again, all these guys have is these guns, so. Yeah, whatever. Alright, now we're ready to move on, and in this area, you will find out that. Alright. Coming through here, and this is where we fight. So, the fastest way to do this is this. And then, yeah, just feel free to do this, and. Freaking. Yeah, now he's dead. So. Yeah, apparently. Homing rockets, yeah. It was way too easy for us. Come through this door. And then you'll find your, uh... Time crystal. Reaper splitters. Oh god. Alright. They respawn. But again, it doesn't matter. We're too fast for them. And that was it. Sweet. Alright. And, uh... Yep, so now, for some reason it goes back down there. Now we have, now we're really in the future now to the year 2000, 2401. So thank you guys very much for watching. In the next episode, we'll handle the space station itself to where we currently are and uh, finish up easy mode, and then I'll see what we do from there. So thank you guys very much for watching. I've been SM72, yours truly, Silver Mario 72 and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.